Hey everyone. So it's interesting. I got this message a couple times throughout this week and I really want to share it with everyone. And I feel like I've touched on this before, but it's like a totally different perspective of the same concept. So spirit was telling me you're a human being, not a human doing. And I can't even tell you how many times I've been told to slow down and just be and ground my energy and bring this space of balance um, to my frequency, to my vibration. And then Spirit gave me this example. And it was like, suppose you're an inventor, you're a famous inventor, and you invented something that really impacted society, right? Now, even though you became famous and it impacted society in a lot of ways, the outcome or the product or whatever's reflected in what you invented is still going to be at the frequency you invented it at. So whatever vibration and energy that you were in when you came up with the idea, when you manifested it and you put it out into the universe and you, you know, put it out there for everyone to experience that same result is going to be what the same vibration you created at basically. And I was like, wow, like that really makes you think like, even if you're doing, 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 if you're in a really stressed out low frequency, you, the, whatever the outcome of is of that, it won't even be that great if you're all stressed out it won't even be that great if you're creating from a vibrational frequency that isn't that great right so it really put this emphasis for me on frequency how I feel in any given moment um what space am I creating from what space am I responding to life from right and the other example spirit gave me was when people pray it's the same concept they're using and a lot of people especially religious people they don't really understand the energy aspect of it but really when you're asking somebody to say pray for a loved one who's sick you're really asking for everybody to bring all their energy together in order to create a positive outcome or solution um, in this situation right and that's very interesting isn't it it's interesting that every <laughs> that people are unconsciously recognizing that there is energy and you can use it in a way to create a different outcome. So we're so much more powerful than we, what we realize because we have control of our own energy. And sometimes we let society and our fast paced culture, our hustle culture try to tell us like we have to create in a certain way or if we're not being productive, we're not worthy. If we're not on the go all the time, then um, that's not equivalent to success. You're lazy, you're whatever. And really peace of peace is success. Like that peace of mind, that coming from that balanced space of like feeling good about life, that's true success. Your currency is your vibrational frequency. And so, yeah, that's what spirit has brought through to me this week and wanted me to share today. I have some things I have to go do, but I really wanted to share that because I wasn't able to get on last week. And I feel like that's an important thing to remember on a day-to-day -day basis, on a moment-to-moment -moment basis, is be mindful of your frequency and what you're creating from. And if you're overdoing it or getting burnt out, to slow down and, and ground and bring that balance back into your space because it's so important. So yeah, guys, I love you and I will talk to you again soon.